hey guys welcome back to my channel so today is going to be a little bit a different video today i'm gonna be showing you guys how i cook my chicken asparagus and yeah let's get into it so first of all i have my um drumsticks here I'll, you, you can use a breast but i feel like drumsticks are much much better and much tastier so i washed them already now i'm just gonna be getting them and drying them and uh I'm going to cut all the meat off of the bone and um, I'm going to leave them skinless so yeah I'm going to be removing the skin and cutting the meat off of the bone so that's what I'm going to be doing let me know you guys if you like such kind of video because I really enjoy cooking and if you do I can like be filming more of these videos for you guys so yeah and by the way Liam is playing I don't know if you can hear him this knife is not so sharp it's not the best knife to use so. So I'm going to be removing all the meat from this like bone literally <laughs> but yeah I'm going to be did I say guys I'm going to be cooking chicken asparagus with rice this is how I'm going to be cutting all the meat of the bone and I have quite like few uh, I'm gonna speed up through these gates and I'll see you later. Okay, guys, so now I'm done. This is my chicken, and I'm not gonna throw away this because this can work as a chicken broth. So I'm just gonna boil them and I'm gonna use this as a broth. So I'm gonna put them all in here. And I'm gonna boil them and I'll just um, keep its water. I'm gonna use it as a sauce here. So yeah, that's what I'm gonna do. Now I'm gonna cut my vegetables and uh, yeah. So now, usually it's best when you have white onion, but I don't have white onion, so I'm gonna use this one. And I'm going to use ginger. And I'm going to use a bit of uh, lemon. And then I'm going to use this white asparagus honestly i couldn't get the fresh one or is fresh is better but i'm gonna use this tinned asparagus here so that's what i'm going to do right now you guys get teary i win <laughs> You cut onions this is not a joke i can never get used to them i don't think there's anybody who gets used to cutting onions honestly because you god oh my god i just need to run and wash my eyes you need to have some cloves of garlic so i'm gonna add garlic to okay i think that would be enough garlic and i'll see you guys in the pan let's go and prepare this chicken okay guys now to show you what i'm gonna be using i'm gonna be using cornstarch and i have salt there i have uh butter asparagus black pepper and i'm going to use some parsley also i'm gonna need some soy sauce and you're supposed to use oyster sauce but i don't have oyster, oyster sauce so i'm gonna be using that steak sauce and then we have our chicken right here and uh some garlic and this is this is ginger and also some onions so that's what we are going to be using those are all my ingredients that we are going to be using today yes love yes baby okay guys now um i have my pan right here and i'm going to put a bit of oil Then I'm going to switch it on on medium high. So now I'm going to add in my chicken.
So now I'm going to uh, I'm going to fry this chicken until it's like brownish. Then I'll take it off. like for um, 10 to 10 minutes like so but as soon as you see it's like turning brown then you take it off so it's like almost even. okay so right now i'm gonna add a bit of salt And then also I'm going to add pepper. Now I don't like spicing it so much because Liam eats with us. So. So now our chicken is done. I'm going to take it off. On the same pan, don't wash. Just add a bit of oil. Now I'm going to add my onions. aroma you guys this smells so nice but I'm going to fry my onions until they are kind of brownish I'm going to add my ginger and then I'm gonna mix it I'm going to add a bit of garlic So now if you guys remember um, my chicken, um, this, the bones that I boiled are going to work as my chicken broth. So I'm going to add this one in here. Then I'm going to add in butter. And now I'm going to add in my asparagus i've cut them in small pieces so i'm going to add in parsley I'm adding in soy sauce. I'm gonna add like two. So I'm going to add in like four because this is not a dark soy sauce. And then I'm gonna add in a little bit of the steak sauce. Just a little bit. That is actually even a lot. Just and then I'm gonna mix it. Mm. 
Then I'm gonna add in my flour or cornstarch, either one of those ones, the one you have, just to make the sauce thick. So I'm going to add that one in there. Then I'm going to mix it. It's already getting thick, actually. Then I'm going to add in my chicken. So I'm just gonna mix it all together and, uh, and then I'm going to let it simmer for like 15 minutes on low heat and then I'll take it off. My rice is here, it's already cooking. I guess it's okay. So now I'm going to put it on low heat. This one's a little bit done. This is like one third of a carrot or mm -hmm. like, like less than this one four. <coughs> that thing will not cook. Hmm? No, that's like this. You know, uh, cut here. It's just like design ring. Yeah. But I think like the original one, of course, is like maybe 200 grams. So did you wash them first? Yeah. Yes, part of this. Mm -hmm. How long until it's done? It's almost done. But why, why is it like, well, that's the sauce, it has to be a brown sauce. Yeah, right? you can make cream, you can make brown. No. Mm -hmm. I think it's done already. Mm -hmm. Good stuff on it. It's mm -hmm. like very babyish. Mm -hmm. You see, I'm here to not even cry. Mm, yeah, when he's watching that one, you can disappear. Okay. okay, guys, now my uh, chicken is like fully cooked and it's just about to serve. Mm, I wish you guys could smell this. It smells so tasty. Okay now guys, our food is ready. Really looks yummy, smells yummy. Another one is for baby Liam. So yeah.